Welcome to today's dumpster diving video. So, we are usually out diving yesterday, what was yesterday for us, but I totally forgot. I told one of the girls I work with that I would work for her, so that didn't work. <laughs> so instead, we're going out today, which I just got off my live with you guys. It was such a fun live. We opened a ton of donations. Thank you guys so much again. You are all amazing. And thank you guys for the super chats. I don't know. I just, you guys work hard for your money and I just don't want you to think I'm one of those channels that like begs for money. Do you know what I mean? Like I do this on my own. I pay for my own gas. Like this is something I'm passionate about. I love donating to people in need and there's such a huge, population now of women, young adults, children, whatever, that are in need because of COVID. I mean, there are so many people that still aren't working and prices are going higher. So in turn, everything else is getting higher. You know what I'm saying. So doing this is just something that I love to do. When I first started doing this, I had no idea it would turn into what it is today. Like I just was skeptical of other dumpster divers and was like, there ain't no way they're finding that stuff in the trash. Well, yes, they were. <laughs> and then it just grew and grew and grew. And, you know, Beth started coming with me and we started exploring more dumpsters over more towns and going out seven to eight hours. I mean, we put in a shift when we go out diving and we started filling the car and like it got to the point where it was like, oh my goodness, what are we gonna do with all this? Because I didn't donate at first. I mean, I donated a little bit like to little church pantries and stuff like that, but they weren't keeping up with it and it made me angry because I would go to donate again and my stuff was there from two weeks ago. So I was like, there's gotta be a better way, you know? And then one of my subscribers, Tara, got in contact with me and here we are today. And it's just amazing. We donate to so many places now. We have the Women and Children's Center. We have the Blackburn Center, which is for abuse women. So sending them, you know, toiletries and um, feminine products and razors and socks, stuff like that, like is what they need because they're leaving their house essentially with nothing on their backs. And you know, it's just, it's just grown so much. Like you guys know, I'm sure you know, everybody that like, if you're new, you don't know, but anybody that's been with me since at least last year or the year before, you know how much it's grown and how passionate we are about helping all these people. And it's just, it's awesome that we have the opportunity and the means to do it. Like I can find all this stuff for free and it's in perfect condition. It's brand new with tags on it most of the time. Most of the time it's food that's not expired. And we can, instead of sending it to the landfill to never be used or eaten or whatever the case may be, we can send it to all of these shelters and help all of these people. And it's just, it's just amazing. You know what I mean? So if you're new here, that's what we do with this stuff. So we find tons of stuff in the dumpsters and we donate it to tons of organizations in need. That being said, let's go get Miss Beth and do the dang thing. All right, guys, we are at five below. We've been checking dumpsters, but haven't found anything yet. Yeah, it's looking like it's just trash. On to the next again, man. No luck so far. We've checked like four dumpsters so far. So hopefully we find something soon. All right, guys, we're, we're at the pet dumpster. Look at the, how sad this is. This is a dumpster that is so full with dog food that they opened. That is unbelievable. There's so many bags of open dog food, but you grab yeah, but there's cans back there. So. We are going to get those keys. Look at that. Fancy Feast cat food back there. They opened all of this. Oh, this is dog food. Cool. See that? I, yeah. And I don't scoop. Because we don't know what bugs landed in here. You know what I'm saying? So. 
we got Royal Canaan dog food. That's less expensive. And there's a big old thing of cat food back there. They opened every single bag of dog food. It's crazy. Two at a time. Skills. Okay, so much for them skills. <laughs> Oh man, it's gone. It's gone forever. Yeah, the Milk Hill Shelter will be enjoying this. That's for sure. I don't have to get in. Oh my god. I'm sinking in dog pit. Ow, I just smacked myself in the face. Ew, I'm getting dog food in my shoes. Mm. Oh yeah, it's all through your shoes. Yep. <laughs> all right, guys, we're at another Dollar General. This dumpster is real nasty. Let me show ya. Like, it's black water. But there's a brand new, I think it's a yoga mat. So, I'm gonna grab that. Out. Thankfully, it's not sitting in anything gross. Is that what this is? Looks like it. Yep. I wonder if there's anything in it. <laughs> no, it's empty. Huh. Oh. Yahtzee. How about them apples? That's a big old grab bag. <laughs> Alright guys, we are just leaving a Dollar General. There's a truck right next to us. I'm sure you could hear it getting uh, unloaded. But their dumpster is like right to the left and you can't see it. So I was like, I'll just get out and go check it real quick. So there was one black bag in there. I opened it up and it had like 20 things of coffee. Um, like, what are they called? Coffee cans. Coffee cans. <laughs> so, yay for us. Family dollar. Let's hope there's something in here. We haven't been having much luck. It's going to be empty. Oh, slippers and shoes. Did you walk into another mm -hmm. spider web? <laughs> Poor Beth. We got slippers. Sandals, some shower shoes. No way. Sweet. It's looking like it. All right. Only got three pairs, three pairs here. Four bubble baths. Not too shabby. We'll take it because we haven't been finding much. I can't wait to see what's in our grab bag from that $1 general. This one super excited about that and the, how cute is that mat though i thought it was like a little yoga mat but it's like an outside mat and let me show you all the coffee look at this i don't even know how i got this out of the dang dumpster to be honest look at all that coffee guys Woo! that's a lot of coffee all right our next dollar general it's looking empty but you never know Just trash. Guys, we are at the next Dollar General. And let's hope there's some goodies in there. Oh man, there's Pop. Let's hope uh, I can get in on the side and see any. Oh man. Does this have wheels on it? Oh, sweet. Oh my goodness, there's lots of stuff in here. Hand sanitizer. We can use a buggy. <laughs> Might as well put it to use. Hex, yeah. Oh, thank you. Let's put you guys. Yeah, we don't want to drop you in the dumpster. We'll put you in the. What you call it? Small. Never seen that come hand sanitizer. I have never either in my life. There's a lot of it too. 
Oh, I found some gachis. How do I keep remembering myself? There we go. Pop up here too. Is there? No coo. Let's see. Let me get us some hand sanitizer, which we're gonna need to use from this oh, next yeah. dumpster. And then there's pop. Oh, then oh there's... I just walked into a spider web. See, yeah, I've been doing it all night. Gross. It's so hard with all these shelves. That one's nasty. Oh, I got a spider over here. Let's see that. Sitting right on the top. Oh, God, it was so bad. Little here. Yeah. There's just so many shots. Ew, it's just so nasty. Oh, I see a big spider crawling. Ew. I'm done. Yeah. <laughs> that that's it for me. Bugs. I hate bugs. <laughs> It stinks. It stinks bad. <laughs> Smells like death in there. Well, we tried. We got some stuff. Alright guys, we're at the next Dollar General. We are hoping and praying there's something in this one. There's a spider web. There might be stuff in that bag right there. The black one? Yeah. Oh, I... Ah! Ah! Is it on you? Oh my God, I don't know what it was. It was a spider web or a moth or something on my face. It was definitely a spider web bar. Oh, sorry guys. I'm sure you just got seasickness there, but that freaked me out. God, I hate bugs. I'm, say. I'm, so, I'm so itchy, guys. <laughs> All right, let's open this up. Yeah, there's cereal in there. Gosh, this dumpster stinks. It sure does. Oh, the bacon, that's Boo. what it is. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, there's dumpster juice on it. Oh, look at that. Ew. We'll take it out of the bag and then just put the bag back in. Oh, it's so gross. It's gonna expire on the 6th, so. though. Oh, yeah, it's still got lots of time. You guys, oh my goodness. I'm so done with bugs. Beth is done with spider webs. I'm done with spider webs and bugs. Yuck. And I had dog, sh dog food in my shoe. I must said dog shoe in my food. Um, so we are gonna go check a one last Dollar General, and then that is it, because we are tired. It is 11.30. And, um, yeah, we're just tired. <laughs> There's that. So we'll go check this last one and then that'll wrap it up. But I'm super excited to see what we get in that one grab bag. So hopefully it's a lot of goodies. All right, guys. Uh-oh. What? Oh, my God. More spider webs. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Other than spider webs. <laughs> oh, so that's going to do it, guys. Definitely not our best, but also not our worst. So, see you in the full reveal. It is not a big one, I will tell you that. But, I mean, some of the stuff we got is pretty dang cool. Like, hello, this little thing. I'll tell you what it is in a minute. And we got a bunch of cereal, pop, which, let me just show y'all what I'm working with, okay? Miss Tara, <laughs> let's pray she's coming this week because oh my goodness, let me show you what my game room looks like behind you. It's it's bad. And don't mind my Halloween direct <laughs> directions, <laughs> decorations. I had to pull out all my fall decor and my Halloween decorations were coming out also, which a lot of them are from the dumpster. The one that you're gonna see is brand new my husband had to buy it so that one isn't from the dumpster but 
wait till you guys see, I'm jumping ahead of myself, but wait till you guys see what I do for Halloween because I'd say 90% of our Halloween decorations are from the dumpster and I cannot wait to show you guys all I do with them. Oh my goodness. But anyway, getting back to today, let me show you guys all the donations and all the dumpster stuff I have for Miss Tara this week. It's insane. We have tons of your donations that we just opened with a bunch of dumpster stuff. And then we have more of your donations. And then donations we have not opened yet are back there. Plus, look at all of the soda, guys. Oh my goodness. Plus, more dumpster stuff. I have to take all that dog stuff to the no-kill shelter and check this girl out. That's what my husband just bought. Spooky, isn't she? <laughs> it's just crazy, all this pop and all of these donations. And there's my toilet paper. <laughs> Showing you that there was a point to that. I'm sure you're like, what the heck was the point of that? The point is, I'm glad we did not get a ton of stuff because where would I have put it? <laughs> like, I'm Beth and I are going diving as soon as I'm done recording this reveal. So, hopefully Tara comes on Tuesday. <laughs> if not, I will have to borrow my hubby's truck again and just take it to her, which is no big deal. Plus, I already took, I don't know, probably, probably 10 six packs of soda to my work for the guys in the back. 10 six packs, and I still have all that. We've been finding nothing but pop lately. It's straight crazy. Okay, but anyway, let's get to this dive because I know that's why you're here. And my shirt keeps making my boobs look weird. Okay, so as you guys seen, we went to a few different dumpsters the other night and we just weren't having the best of luck. We had a lot of luck with spider webs, a lot of luck with bugs, but not a lot of luck with all the goodies in the dumpsters. So we went to a bunch of Dollar Generals, a family dollar, and a pet dumpster. So I'm just gonna flip y'all around, show you everything we got from all of those places at once. Then we're gonna open together that grab bag that is peeking out behind me, which let me move out the way. There you go. <laughs> then we're gonna open up that grab bag together. I have not even peeked in it. So you and I will be surprised at the same time. God, I pray there is no raw meat in there. <laughs> so let's show you what Beth and I found at the dumpsters. Starting in the back with our soda from the Dollar General, we got a 12 pack of Sprite cans, two Coca-Cola cans, a five out of six pack of Coke Zero mini cans, and three six packs of Sprite. Plus, as you guys seen in the video, we stopped at another Dollar General their truck was in their dock, so I, I was like James Bond, <laughs> 007 in it, man. I was like creeping into that dumpster to see what they had, and to my surprise, they had a garbage bag filled with those coffee cans, and they only ripped one top off and dumped it in the bag and left all those completely fine, and just so you know, these are probably going to be on the penny list soon, but their sell-by date is not until August 17th of 23, so... If they're not on the penny list now, expect them to be soon because Beth and I always find stuff like a week or two ahead of the penny list. And those of you that don't know what the penny list is, watch Krista Coupons. She explains it all on her channel. That's how I found out what the penny list is. And those are mostly the items we always find in the dumpsters, FYI. Yeah. The $1 General that had the soda, we also got all of those suave hand sanitizers. We went to the Family Dollar and got two pairs of men's shower shoes and one pair of, I guess they would be men's or women's uh, slippers. We got four bottles of Mr. Bubble Bubble Bath, one package of men's boxers, which I can take that little tag off. I just need to use my wire snips. So I will do that before I donate it, of course. We went to the pet dumpster and we got all of those cans of dog food and that huge package of Fancy Feast cat food. The only reason why it was thrown away is because there's a hole in the bag. Yes, just a hole. Nothing wrong with the cat food, nothing wrong with the dog food. So it'll go to the no-kill shelter and they will be oh so happy with it. 
we went to the other Dollar General where you guys seen the dumpster juice was <laughs> unfreaking real and it stunk so freaking bad. Thankfully, it did not go inside the bag and we were able to save all of these frosted flakes which are coming up on their Best Buy date, which is September 6th of 2022, which might even be today or yesterday. I don't know. I don't know what the date is. Then we went to the dumpster where we found this. I just peeked my little nugget in and I've seen this and I thought it was a um, like a yoga mat. It is a easy mat. Just says you can take it to the park or at the beach, whatever. But, you know, it's, I mean, I guess it is kind of cool. We seen there was that black bag in that dumpster and I was like, ooh, there's some stuff in here. And I am freaking dying to see what's in that bag. So you and I are gonna go through it together and hope and pray there is no funky bacon or anything like that in there. So let's go open it up and see what's in it. What do we got in here? I hope there's something good in here. <laughs> this is gonna be a real crappy reveal. <laughs> Oh, okay. It's okay. It's okay. We got chocolate caramel crunch. I have never seen these before in my life. Have you guys? August 13th, 22. So it just went out of its best by date, but we all know how that is. We got, oh my God, look at the little microwave. Does it open? Doesn't it not open? Oh, it opens. That is so cute for a little kiddo. It just needs some batteries and like a piece of tape over that. We got more taco, what is it? Chocolate, taco, chocolate caramel crunch cereal. Oh, I love finding socks. Little kids socks, brand stinking new in the dumpster, in the trash. Like why? Oh, I cannot deal with that. It seriously burns my biscuits. We got a package of Cheez-Its, white cheddar. They're a little crushed, but they're still fine. Look at how cute this sign is. Why would you throw that? Oh, it's missing the little thing on the back. But I, I'll still use it. Yes, I will. We got a... <laughs> Peanut's gonna love this. A little dog gingerbread squeaky toy. We got um, some Kid Squad shark stickers. Set of frozen... Um, um, <laughs> what are these? Shape sticker, sh <laughs> shape cards. Like they are telling you what the color is and what the shape is. And in, mixed in with them is a regular deck of playing cards. So I will separate all these and um, donate them. We got a plush pumpkin, I love that. Oh my word, a doctor set. What is wrong with that? Why did they throw that away? You know what I mean? Five bucks. That is so stinking adorable. Some kiddo will love that. Ooh, more socks, more socks. There's more socks. <laughs> we got these kiddo socks, which there's some loose also in the bag. It's the box of cards, which most of them are in there. Bag O flour, which is dry and there is nothing wrong with it. So that's a great donation. We got hair ties, a little water, a uh, kid's water toy that squirts water out. Another pack of cards, more hair ties. We got a totally gnarly fruit punch scented hydrating face mask. Oh, you know what? I wonder if this went on. Oh, it did. I can glue that back on there. Oh, yes I can. A Little bit of glue and we'll be good to go. We got a fake hot dog, <laughs> a fake weenie. Not sure why. Yeah, I don't know what else. Ooh, we got a headset. Is it in here? It is. We got a swivel microphone headset. Cool. And we also got some spider rings. The kiddos love stuff like that. Oh, we got a bunch of little kid food, like kitchen food to play with like plates, American cheese, the top of a burger bun, little knives. I guess the packaging just fell apart. I don't know. Tomatoes. That's what the hot dog goes in. Where's my little wiener at? There it is. So that is adorable and some little kiddos will love to play with that for sure. And there's about a million dollar general bags in here that have not been used. So we will take those out and use them. I put 
small bags like these in my trash cans, like in my bathrooms and bedrooms and laundry rooms, stuff like that. We also got some sea salt, caramel, Ghirardelli little squares that are individually wrapped. So those are still good. And then the rest is just cards that I need to take out and put together and a bunch of opened warheads, which are these. Oh, these are individually wrapped too. So huh, how about them apples? Well, I will take those out and donate them as well. And that, my friends, is everything we found at the dumpsters. Which, again, was not our best score, but was not our worst. I will tell you that. And we are going out again tonight, so I have a good feeling about tonight. Because this is a night we never go out on. Because I'm normally at work. But because of Labor Day, I am off today because we are closed for the next two days. So that makes my heart happy because I was able to go to the girls cheerleading game earlier or the football game that they cheered at, I should say. And it was so awesome to be able to stay for the whole time and watch my little peanuts cheer their little hearts out. It is so cute. I will have to put in a clip of their halftime routine because oh my goodness, it's adorable. So I will say goodbye to you now and leave you with a little clip of the girls cheerleading halftime routine because it is just oh so stinking cute. And I of course will talk to you all in those comments down below. And until next time guys, happy dining. Five, four, three, two, one.